to pivot to beliefs. Because what I realized pretty quickly when I stumbled across your words, Capil, is that I had a whole lot of beliefs about the world and I pretended as though those were the truth because they felt so real to me. My beliefs must be true, right? Otherwise, why would I have them as a belief? And over the last couple of years, I've gotten really good at letting go of belief, setting them down is probably a way to talk about it. But I do find myself picking them up again and again. And can you help me understand what's behind that? Well, you like anything that's yours. Mm. I mean, if, if something, if either something is true or it's not true, what does it matter what you believe? What does it matter what your opinion is? Of, of what value is that? aside from trying to win some idiotic conversation in some idiotic party with a bunch of idiots, talking idiocy. Who cares what you believe? Of, of, of what, what, what two cents does it matter what your opinion is? And, and, and once again, because everyone's conditioned, they're going to think that I, I mean that you should be mindful of others' opinions. No, I'm saying others' opinions are stupid too. Everyone's stupid. They're all stupid. Either something is true or it's not true. What you believe and what you opine, who cares? You can believe that the sun rises in the north. Okay, you're welcome to believe that once again. No evil. So what? Okay, good for you. Your opinion is that the moon is purple with green stripes. Great. Good for you. What does that have to do with reality? So then it just comes down to, are you more interested in opinion and belief? Or are you more interested in reality and truth? And there's no way that anyone is not going to hear the fact or the, the notion that I'm implying something that I'm implying that you should be interested in reality and truth. And that's where my stuff differs. I don't imply anything. Once again, I don't care. It is simply, I can't say a single thing without there being a feeling that I'm giving a hidden, I, I, I'm leading you toward doing something. And, and the reason that that happens is because every single human being that you speak to in your entire life Every single book that you read in your entire life absolutely is trying to lead you somewhere, has a message for you, has something for you to get, has a take-home message. I don't have any message. I don't care if you look for truth or you care for belief. I am just simply making the absolute fact statement with no judgment, no leading, no implication, that are if you are more interested in belief and, and opinion, then that's what you will value. And if you're more interested in reality and truth, that's what you, are, that's what you will value. What, what you will value. And you shouldn't be more interested in one or the other. You are whatever you are. Did you enjoy this standalone Patreon highlight? If so, you can listen to full episodes of the Minimalist Private Podcast, available exclusively on Patreon. Visit patreon.com slash the minimalists or click the link in the description. Your support keeps our podcast and YouTube channel 100% advertisement free.